Number one is faith. I learned that like in this industry, not just this industry, just in life in general, without faith, it's very hard to manifest like dreams that that you have. Like if you don't fully internalize and fully believe in that dream that you have, like there's literally no way that other people are gonna be like, oh yeah, well I believe it and you don't. Like it's, it's impossible. So that's number one completely believe in yourself and have faith in the process and faith that it'll happen and not and not faith that it'll happen now but faith that it will happen like you can't put a time stamp on when it'll happen like you that's not in your control so that's important secondly discipline because it's very easy to get lost in everything like there's so many different things that come with being an artist and when you get like a little bit of notoriety like there's just there's so many distractions and so many things that'll take you away from what you were originally intended to do so I think that's important like you have to make sure you take time aside to really get what you need to get done if you know that you're trying to work on a project book studio time Make sure if people are like, oh, let's go out, or I haven't seen you, whatever, like, you have to learn how to say no to friends and family. You have to know how to say no to boyfriends and girlfriends and literally, like, take time to build yourself and, you know, get yourself to the level that you're trying to get to. Three would probably be, be dope. <laughs> like, like, literally, I, I feel like a lot of people are so busy trying to be something that they made up in their head instead of just being themselves. And I learned that people attract to you immediately when they feel like you're being real. Like when they feel like, wow, I, I know that person a little bit. Like you could literally say one little thing that can remind them of like a friend or of themselves. If they feel like you're being real and true to yourself, it'll like, it will click. It's, it's weird. And when you're putting on a front, people can tell. And you can think that they can tell, but they can always tell. So be you, do you, be dope and believe in yourself. I have a fourth one. Pay attention to the business aspect of it. Very important. Me personally, like I've been through a roller coaster of trials and tribulations that have taught me now how to like properly handle my business. But if you can, now we have we have so many like knowledgeable like interviews and all kinds of things online that you could look into and find out percentages and find out what you should do to not get screwed over and what you deserve and what this person is supposed to be doing when they give you this kind of deal and when you sign your name on a contract what this person's responsibility is and if they're not supposed to do it how you can get out of it and you know what I'm saying so please do your homework find out like but you have to value your, yourself if you don't you're, you're not going to care you're going to be like oh well this is something I love to do, so I'll do it for free or whatever. That's cool, but at the end of the day, you have to eat. And it's important to not get screwed over, so pay attention to that. Look up as many things as possible. Ask people if you need questions. Ask, DM your favorite artist. Like, sometimes people reach back. Like, people will literally hit you back. Like, I've made, like, a lot of connections on a production tip through, like, DMing people. And I'm just like, hey, let's work. I want to work with you. And sometimes it's like really big producers and I'm like, oh, they're not going to hit me back. And they do. Go in it boldly and try to figure out as many things as you can. And yeah. And good luck to you. Kill it. <laughs>